So, it's broken, playing everything. Here's what we were left with. I just wanted to give some final thoughts on this game, because I, I loved it dearly. It meant a lot to me. It, it crushed my soul a bit. Every time I launch it now, of course, it just comes to the screen. Any button you hit that would normally work in the game just cuts it off. I'll even have to kick the volume down. I can't get the volume settings. All that works was F8 for full screen. Um, I know how to delete my save. And it's not the simplest thing in the world. Even if you uninstall and reinstall, it, it would still come back here. You can take a couple steps, though, and you can do it proper and you can start over. But that was never the point. It's like Googling a spoiler, right? So, and by that I mean, you know, the point was to play the game one time. If I just short-circuit that idea intentionally, just like many of you could very easily figure out and, and do, <laughs> right? Then it, it hurts the point. The message they were trying to get across in this as, as a form of art. And this game stuck with me. You know, like after I beat Cuphead, there was plenty of... There were plenty of videos after that doing expert modes and stuff where, like, the story calms down in your system, you know? Like, I got amped up, I beat it, it was great. And then it was fun, the challenge of expert mode. With this game, it put me on the feel train, which was melancholy, but I mean, heartfelt, amazing. All these deep emotions really swirled around inside me. And I felt like, like I'd just been stabbed in the heart when I finished the game. And I want to respect what they've done enough to linger on that for a bit. So, I'm just not going to play it for a while. Uh, I'm not going to Google the ending I missed, the secrets I missed. I'm not going to look up anything. Because obviously I had to make a choice and I made it. I'm just going to kind of work on other stuff for a bit. And I, I just put up about a video a day, generally. And this was, you know, I don't know, 16 parts or something? So maybe a couple weeks from now, when all those parts have gone up, right after this video, I'll be able to go ahead and, and give you the rest of the game, the other playthrough. Or maybe I'll wait months. I'm, I'm not sure yet. I, I'm going to take some time to think on it. I'm going to take some time to feel what you're supposed to feel. Because uh, this game did it. 10 out of 10. I, I couldn't even gather my thoughts at the time of beating it because it was so... It was so final. There was no hitting New Game Plus. There's no go again. There's no, let's go to the cinematics menu, see if we missed anything. I like that one cinema. Let's go to the viewer. No, this is it. This game is very, very pragmatic and very emotional. Very heartfelt in that this is it. You had one shot. And I took it. And man, it, it really sits with you. If you're the kind of person that can get into this sort of thing, not everybody can. That's fine. Um, when done a certain way, I won't even say like done correctly, right? When done a certain way, this art form can really speak to me because correctly is the wrong word. You know, there's plenty of games that I can't quite get into, relate to the character on, etc. that other folks might cry their eyes out. All I can say, all I can do is speak for me and say that thank you, Cooverton, for buying this game specifically so I'd play and record it. That's a big show of support that I sincerely appreciated. And I appreciate the emotional journey I got to go on because of it. And I'm on the fence, but maybe sometime I'll, I'll go and go the other route. There's achievements left that most folks, you know, they, they just don't get it in their shot, and that's that. <laughs> I didn't have to save the, the plant lady. That was all on the side, you know. I didn't have to, like, the tube of water and, like, the miracle grow or whatever that I mixed into the tube. None of that was required. You just have that one shot, and it, that's just like life. I love it. I love the symbolism of it all, that, you know, you don't just... In the real world, you can't just rewind or redo or do over or click the difficulty down, you know. In the real world, life just sort of happens at you, and you rarely get second chances. The real world's like this. I love that. I love that for what it is. And it meant enough to me that I wanted to... Add this epilogue video on the end to, to just sort of clarify on some of those thoughts. So, uh, yeah. Thank you an incredible amount to all the people that, that watch. Obviously, I don't have millions. I don't have thousands. I don't even I have... I don't have hundreds. I don't even have dozens. But it's so special to me even to see one view. One person that's, that's willing to give me a chance. And maybe I'm getting to do something for them. I love that. So 
feel free to like, comment, subscribe. And when you comment, you know, I mean something meaningful. If, if there's something I could do different, something I can prove, something I could do to make your day. I'm at a point where some personal requests I can fulfill. Like my buddy Coover got me one shot, so I played on through it. Um, uh, I hope this puts a smile on your face, and I hope you enjoyed going on this emotional journey with me. I look forward to a lot of them in the future, interspersed with a lot of BS, ridiculous, dumb, childish games that I'll play. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care. Bye.